Hello students, how are you? I hope you all are doing well. So dear students, today I am going to demonstrate an experiment related to Boyle's law. So you can see we are going to perform an experiment that is Boyle's law experiment. First of all you understand that a gas has four variables that is pressure, volume, temperature and N means mass of gas mass of gas and volume of gas both are completely different thing. so in these four variables take any two variable as a constant and the remaining two variables which is left between them we have to find the relationship so Boyle's law says that pressure is inversely proportional to its volume what does it mean it means that if you increase the pressure, volume of a given gas will decrease at, at constant, constant temperature and mass of the gas. So what will be constant? Temperature and N. Okay. N is number of mole. Okay, that will be constant. Then when we increase the pressure, then volume will get decreased. To do this, we need some materials. That is a bottle, a air pump, a balloon, and a nozzle that is used in cycle tube. So let's go and see the experiment. So students, uh, to perform this boys like experiments, we required some material that is uh, one straw okay this straw we need this nozzle you can see this nozzle uh, this is of a bicycle tube and we have just fixed this in a cap of a bottle so in this bottle what we have to do we have to inflate this balloon and i will use this straw to inflate this balloon why because when you will put bal balloon mouth in the mouth of this bottle and when you will blow it you cannot inflate this balloon because air in present in this balloon should pass out so with the help of this i have inflated it here now what we have to do we have to close it completely and you need a air pump and i will use this uh, pump which is used to fill the air in the bicycle so by this i will fill air in this bottle so now you can see this balloon is a stuck here it is not coming down now what we will do we will just apply a high pressure inside this bottle in this case what will happen the balloon the whatever the area it is occupied okay balloon will get a smaller means balloon will get compressed when will the pressure when we will increase the pressure of this uh, bottle then what will happen it will apply a pressure upon this balloon in that case the volume volume of a gas which is filled in the balloon that will get compressed and that only Boisla says that when you increase the pressure we will increase the pressure inside this bottle the volume of the gas which is filled in the balloon that will get decreases so let's do this experiment so students you can see I am using uh, this uh, laboratory stand to fix that uh, bottle so I will just fix that bottle in this like this okay you can take help with your uh, brother or sister to hold this bottle because we need to fix this bottle as like this so I can apply pressure in this bottle so you have to look very closer to this bottle balloon size so I will just bring it near to the camera okay so you can see now now what we will do I will fix this one in the nozzle nozzle of the cycle tube that is a one way traffic that only allow to enter the air in this uh, bottle but it uh, stop the air flowing from out so here now I will pump this 
so if we will increase the pressure the volume of this balloon will get decreased and it will fall down in this bottle so now you can see as much pressure applied this balloon is not falling down but now while i will apply pressure in this So now, as you can see, I will just uh, pump air into this uh, bottle. So this, uh, the volume of the gas which is present in this balloon will get decreased. So let's uh, start. So I will just apply pressure in this bottle. Now you, uh, now I can just press this bottle very easily. So just I will. Now see the size of the balloon. Now you can see the size of the balloon gets smaller and now as we will lose the pressure now this balloon size will get increased so just see the size of this balloon so you can see the size of the balloon get increases so what happened if increase the pressure the volume of the gas which is present in this volume get decreases as we release the pressure of this bottle then again the volume of the gas which is present in this volume get increases so that only explains boyle's law that pressure is in inversely proportional to its volume so if you increase the pressure volume get decreases if you decrease the pressure volume get increases so now you can see now again it is stuck into this Okay, it is stuck into this. Now, if I will do lot of effort, then also this balloon can cannot come out. So again, we can fill the air, and we will increase the pressure. Let's see if if size will get decrease, then it will fall down. And if this is not falling, let's see. Now what happens? The size of this balloon get decreases. So I have applied more pressure in that case, and that balloon get bursted. Okay, but experiment is completed. So thank you. This was our uh, today's experiment of the Boyle's law.